do you manage motherhood slash fatherhood and work when the kids are so small and you don't have any help? So she needs advice on how to manage motherhood when her kids are so small. Tell, tell, tell uh, share your uh, uh, Zoomy story. <laughs> Desperate, desperate times call for desperate measures. No, you, you, I took, it's desperate, yeah. but at the same time, it's 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 the old saying like yeah. you, you know it doesn't matter how many resources you have; it matters how resourceful yeah. you are. Yeah. So my initial answer, I'm gonna, I will tell that story. My first thought was ask for help. Mm-hmm. There, like, there's help out there. If sure. that means you have a girlfriend that you guys trade off babysitting, you're their kids. Like another single, there's another single mom. You know, I guarantee it. There's a lot of them. You know, this night. She has all the kids. You get to go take care of you. You get to go do whatever that is and swap it around. Like ask for help. There's, you can go to your, ch- your local church and get a directory mm-hmm. and find young girls that'll work for cheap and babysit for you. Like there, there is a way. Um, there was a time when my oldest was really little and I worked uh, at the mall and I couldn't find a babysitter. I don't, it was so long ago. I don't remember why, but I like, I only had me and have, I, I had my own apartment. I had to pay my own bills. And so I thought, eh, I'll just take him to work with me. And I put him in a box behind the cash wrap and gave him a Subway sandwich and some books. Thankfully, he's a chill kid. And he just sat in a box until I figured out what to do with him because I just went to work. I was, I was banking on asking for forgiveness if I got in trouble way more than, you know, getting in trouble for not being at work. No one ever got mad at me. I had a pretty cool manager, Mm -hmm. but you know, it is, it's like, I was resourceful. I made a decision that like I had a responsibility to both and a responsibility to my child and to my job and I brought him to work. So Mm -hmm. you can, there, there is always means to, to making everything happen. You know, there's, there's story after story after story. Yeah. The other thing that I would suggest too is as like the owner of a company, and having multiple employees, like I'm open to things. I'm flexible on things. I've had experiences with some single parents that work for me that are like, hey, the weeks changed or this happened or that happened. Yeah. Can I bring my kid? Sure. You know what I mean? Like I'm I'm open to that. So if, if you're a single parent sitting in a, a position where you think that there's no, you know, uh, ability for you to make moves or whatever, make some moves. Have some conversations. If you yep. don't talk to your boss, you don't talk to your coworkers, whatever, whatever. The answer is always going to be no, but there's always, as you said, there's always a way to make something happen. Mm-hmm. The question always. is, is are you resourceful enough mm-hmm. to do it? 